I went too reckless. Nothing wrong with having a little fun. What's up, GQ? I'm Elijah Mitchell. This is how I made, saved, and spent my first $1 million. I'm from a small town called Erath, Louisiana. I'm surrounded by sugar cane fields, country stuff, so it's really fun. I like riding four wheelers, fishing, uh, hunting, so that's all things I love to do. I didn't have any jobs growing up, but I still helped my dad around the house, uh, cutting grass and just helping him with things he had to do. He didn't give me any money, but uh, somebody had to do it, and I, I was the last one in the house, so uh, it had to get done. But my dad was very impactful to me. He taught me right from wrong and to always work hard and to always do what I'm supposed to do. I have four brothers, four older brothers. I really couldn't do everything with them because they was older than me. So uh, I was always the one stuck at the house and helping my dad, so that's how all that started. At first, I wasn't thinking about football, like being able to play football in, a, in the league. I have to say my sophomore year, that's when my recruiting process really picked up a lot. It was a lot of pressure, uh, especially being from a small town in Erath. Nobody really came out of there and made it to the NFL. That was the, UL was the only school that that offered me that was like in my area. Everybody from Erath, they came to UL, it was like a 20 minute drive, so it was really, my hometown really came support and everything. I have to say my, my freshman year, I ended up coming in, I ended up starting, and I really tore it up on the field that year, so I was like, man, this could be a, the league could be a opportunity for me to go. It was like, is it the right opportunity to leave right now or because we had the old COVID year. So it was like, am I ready to go? At that point in time, I was like, you know what? It's time for me to go. I just got to work hard and continue to do good. Six rounds. Six what rounds. What was that like waiting for your name to be called? By the time round five came around, I was kind of like, oh man, what's, what's about to happen? Like, will I go and draft it? Six round came, San Francisco 49ers picked me up and it's the best day of my life. It was just like, my dream came true and it's like, I'm, I made it. And like I said, it's something that you work for your whole life and it was right in front of me on a piece of paper. It took a little bit before it hit me. You heard how I made my money. Now let's talk about how I spent my first million. First thing I bought was a house in Erath. That was for my family. 300K, my house in Erath. The next thing I spent my money on was a car. All black Mercedes SUV. 100K for my car. I do have a financial advisor and that costs about 10K. Just having all this money, you gotta make sure you don't spend too much so you end up going broke. Hey, don't miss that. I bought a chain, it says 25J E E E. It stands for my girl and my, my little babies. 20K jewelry from Leo Frost. Really, I just wanted a, a number 25 to represent my football number and my girl and my babies, that's who I do it for. Yeah, the gauge ring was another uh, big expense. I didn't have an idea how much I wanted to spend on it. My girl, she picked it out, so whatever she wants goes. 15K for engagement ring. I spent 300K on my kids. I was between uh, cars, little cars for them, clothes, and shoes. I got one a Ferrari and I got one a, a Jeep. It's a little small cars, so uh, they, they're, they're able to drive them right now. Football? Yeah, I definitely think my kids are gonna be playing football. Are they already getting into it? Yeah, my three year old's getting into it right now. He be a running back, like his dad. I haven't had the time yet, but I put aside 100K for vacation. I just me and a wife. 50K on a night out in LA. My uh, friends went back home and we went to the catch. We had 15 bottles and really wasn't even paying attention. We just, we were just ordering as we go. Yeah, I definitely get back to my friends. They've been my day ones since I started this whole thing. I want to shout out my homeboys, Steven, Jalen, Bryn, and Ben. I spent about 50K on tattoos. Uh, my tattoo artist, his name is called Smash. Uh, he's back home. I have a bunch of tattoos on my chest, on my arm. As soon as I get back, I'm going to get my sleeve finished. Chest was the most painful. I heard the ribs are painful, but I haven't got that done yet. Yeah, I'm used to the pain right, about now. My favorite tattoo, I have a blessed on my arm, and that just represents like my whole life, just blessed being in the position I am. I have another tattoo on my stomach. My three kids, Emerson Elliott and uh, Eden. Donated 50K to my high school in Ira. Yeah, it's particularly to the football program, just for like new equipment in the weight room. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. That's where I came from. Have you gone back to visit? 
Not yet. Uh, I'll be going back soon. I went too reckless. I had, it, nothing wrong with having a little fun. You know what I'm saying? Do you have any advice for guys coming into the league that are getting their first paycheck? It's all right to splurge a little bit, but just make sure you have a financial advisor and you just save your money because you never know when it's going in. Thanks for tuning in, guys, and I can't wait to see y'all on the field next year.